Hi guys, this is Grandma Cheap Cheap and welcome back to my kitchen here in Southern Colorado. And today I want to uh, share with you a restaurant, a, a recipe for those restaurant baked potatoes. You know those um, potatoes that have the good crusty salt on them and they just taste so good you almost don't even have to put salt on them because it just sinks into the skin of the potato. Well, I'm going to share with you what uh, I call my own restaurant baked potatoes. We're going to start with um, just baking potatoes or russet potatoes, whatever you have. I've washed them and the way I prepare my um, potatoes is to take a, a sponge and I only use the sponge for washing off carrots and turnips or potatoes or whatever. So uh, I got it from the dollar store and I've taken it over to the sink and washed my potatoes. Um, the vegetable oil or cooking spray and then this is the salt um, that you can get from the dollar store and it's in the form of a shaker so in my my baking dish I'm going I wash my potatoes I'm going to put my my oil on the potatoes and I, I just take a little bit of oil in my hands rub it together just like you're going to grease your hair or something. <laughs> okay. A little more oil. And just rub your potato skins. Just a dot. until they are nice and shiny. Now this big one needs a little bit more oil on it. And since I already have my oven on, I want to take advantage of, uh, of that and put these in, in the oven as well. Now, I'm going to just get my salt shaker here and generously just put salt all over my potatoes. Okay, with that done, at 350, I'm going to put them in the oven until they are done. I don't know exactly how long it will be, but um, you can uh, test them by just sticking a fork in them. If they're for tender, I guarantee you these will taste just like those restaurant-style baking potatoes. So thank you so very much for um, rolling with me here at Grandma Cheap Cheap's channel. Uh, please subscribe. Follow me on Twitter at Grandma Cheapo. Uh, you can email me at Grandma Cheap Cheap at gmail.com. But uh, just thank you so very much for um, subscribing to me. And if you haven't subscribed, please do. And don't forget to leave a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Thanks so much and have a great evening. Okay, you guys? Bye-bye now.